So everyone, uh, I've been away from YouTube for a while. Uh, y'all are probably wondering why. Uh, as of right now, I'm not gonna say it's not bad. I just don't want to put it out there on the internet. Uh, some personal reasons, uh, family reasons, but uh, I'm not gonna put it out there for everybody. Uh, it's kind of I'm dealing with it on my by myself. But for the most part, it's, uh, well, I might as well. My mom passed, so, right here, she's in. And, I just haven't been putting videos up as, as much because I haven't wanted to because of it. And, I figured today might be a good reason, or might be a good day to post um, put something up for y'all. But uh, it's just weird, you know. My mom was somebody I could talk to, somebody I could get out certain things on, and very something about my mom was she was she helped me. And how she helped me was, well, I can't make a lot of decisions on my own. Because when I, when I make a decision, then afterwards, I feel really bad about it. So, or I can't make it because I don't know. I don't know what, what I want. And my mom always kind of helped me with that. She kind of picked for me. And I asked her, like, what do you think I should do? Like, I was playing uh, Tony Hawk's Proving Ground on, my cha on a channel that I had before. And I asked her which team I should get sponsored by. And she kind of told me what she what she would go with. So, it kind of helped me because that's what I picked. And certain colors on certain things she'd, she'd pick for me because I couldn't. I, I just didn't know how to pick them proper, 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 <laughs> properly because of... I'm indecisive, I guess you could say. But the worst thing is, my mom was somebody I could absolutely talk to. No matter what it was. But enough of that, because it's just going to get me into weirdness. And I don't feel like talking to the camera all about, all about everything. But the main thing I wanted to say was... Whoever you are, whatever you are, whatever you're doing at this moment, just tell somebody that you're that you're sitting next to, or whatever it is, whoever you're sitting next to, whatever you're sitting next to, if it's your mom, your dad, your sister, your brother, your your cousins, your aunts, what whoever it is, your dog, your cat, whatever you're sitting next to, tell them that you love them, because at any moment that person can be taken from you. I didn't expect my mom to go. At the age of 42, you know, me being 19, it's not easy. And it's a heck of a lot not easier that she just went into the hospital just for, like, an asthma attack. That's all it was. And then this. She has that, She had asthma all her life. Well, not all her life. After I lost my asthma, she kind of grew into hers. But it, it's just it's just the worst thing ever to me, and I just felt like a something, kind of a sit down and chill with me kind of video, you know. Get to get into my life a little bit more, get into the grief and crap and, you know, all the good crap. But he's my puppy. That's my bud, you know. I love this dog. And, well, life is weird for me, because I come home every day expecting, you know, oh, put my mom on the couch, sitting there. I find her sitting on the couch, like that never happened. It's not going to happen, and I'm still not in connect with that I really don't want to accept it yet but I know 